Good morning, friends. It is Monday, and today we're supposed to officially start our homeschooling schedule. And honestly, I think that schedule is just going to fly out the window because the schools actually made their own schedule of a lot of times the kids need to get on to a device um, to have like FaceTime with their teacher. If they miss it, it is recorded so they can go back and watch it. But so that schedule, I'll probably have to redo it or just toss a schedule. I don't know. I'm feeling <laughs> very overwhelmed today. I had a whole plan that we were going to just follow the schedule because the online stuff actually starts Wednesday. But I thought we'll try to get into a groove the next two days. I was going to have the kids up and dress with their chores done and breakfast before eight o'clock. And it's eight o'clock. <laughs> Nobody's awake except for me. I got up around 7.15 and I did my yoga and then I got dressed. And now I'm just having my cup of coffee, which tastes really good. I woke up with a really bad headache. Um, I thawed some bagels last night because we have bagels on the menu. They can have it with peanut butter, cream cheese, or just regular butter. Plus, the schools are doing free lunch and free breakfast, um, so we'll probably utilize that at least three times a week. Not sure if we're doing that today, but we will be using that to help save on groceries because when I make sandwiches, even though the three little ones have one bread, like we go through a whole loaf of bread really fast and I can make bread. And I actually did that a couple days ago, but that goes really fast too. I'm just... Filling up my sink with some water, some hot water, because the kids had snacks last night and left me dishes. They didn't put them away and they didn't wash them. So I'll just let those soak and I'll just go ahead and start the bagels and start waking them up. I kind of don't want to wake them up because I really enjoy this quiet time, but they need to get back on a schedule. Some sort of schedule. Drag out the toaster. And I actually have some bagels in the cupboard. There's two left, so I'm gonna use those first before I open these. Okay, so I have not made breakfast. Now it is 8.30 and the kids are still not awake. I'm still drinking my coffee. My head hurts so bad. I really think that schedule I made two vlogs ago is not gonna work, but I mean, we'll try some of it. I need to go wake them up because, and I forgot Kennedy has an appointment today too. I don't know you guys, this is gonna be challenging. I think when Adam goes back to work, cause he's gotta be at work at four, I'll start getting up at five again and doing my workout like I was doing. And I need, it's like, I need to get myself back on a routine to get the kids on a routine. If that makes any sense, I don't know. Okay, I can't put it off any longer. Actually, I think I hear footsteps. Good morning! Good morning, Kennedy! Yeah, it's CJ's birthday and Lauren's birthday. Good morning! Are you ready to do school? <gasps> no. We'll start with Jillian. Jillian! Jilly, it's time to get up. It's time to wake up, hon. It's the first day of homeschooling. Come on, I'll open up your windows. It's a nice day outside. Come on. <laughs> Wes, it's time for school. Time to get up. Come on, dude. Wesley. Wes. Good morning. We gotta get your diaper off, okay? Are you tired? <laughs> oh, 
Okay, you guys, here comes the scary part. I have to go wake up the three older kids. That's never fun. Tiffany, it's time for school. Time to get up, get dressed, make your bed, have breakfast. Jack. It's a mess down here. Allie, it's time to get up. You slept with your heater on? Uh, yeah. Come on, get up. No, you. I am up and dressed. Let's go. We have school. Don't come up till your your room's clean, but make your bed and get dressed. Your room is clean. I, that's what I just said. Your room's clean, so make. Yeah. You didn't even sleep in your bed. No wonder you're freezing. Come on. Come on, Tiff. I'm adjusting the light. Come on. Stop. <laughs> Here comes Jack. Parker! No. Good morning! It's time to get up. Come on, it's already 8.30. We're already an hour behind schedule. No. Come on, it's time to get up. No. Let's go, it's time for school. No. Why'd you turn this thing off? Ginger, it's time to get up. I see your eyeball. Good morning. Good morning, Ginger. Make sure she has food because she doesn't have any. Come on, you need to get up and feed the hamster. Okay. Make your bed. Come on. Mom. <laughs> okay, the kids are in motion, so I'm gonna start putting these bagels in. What's the matter? Do you want a bagel? We need to do your drops. You want to go to school? Oh. I know you want to go to real school. I want you to go to real school too, trust me. I've never wanted anything so much in my life. You're hungry? So, we, um, we save these kind of bags. We don't throw them away. Same thing with cereal bags. And like oh, these, no. you never know when you'll need one. Um, cause we use them for the kitty litter. So we try to reuse things. Even when I buy plastic forks and spoons, I I will wash them like five, six times before I throw them away. And my kids are like, "What's the point?" We just we don't have a lot of forks. We have a ton of spoons and not a lot of forks. I don't know. The set we got was weird. I really need to just buy buy some more forks. Okay, that's going. I've had my coffee. Jillian and Kennedy are dressed and just waiting on the other kids. Okay, guys, we're getting there. They're eating breakfast. Okay, so breakfast is over. Oh, it's cold out here. And we're just going to go on a family walk just down the street because the can't go to the parks so just to get some a little bit of exercise good shot
the school we are going to actually do the free lunch and free breakfast today so for breakfast they're giving out cereal and milk and for lunch it's fresh fruit a non-crustable sandwich and juice i think um so they can eat either either one for lunch today or for a snack okay we're at free lunch we don't get out of the car they just hand out the trays to you It's right. really cool that they're doing this and that. Quiet so that we can utilize it to help save on our on our groceries because they would be eating lunch at school. Anyways, so unless it's different now that it's actually schools in session, but no, it's in cars. But there's got to be families that don't have people. Okay, we got our free stuff and bags. Okay, so now we've moved on to academic time. So they're working on their worksheets from school. Well, Kennedy's eating cereal because she's Kennedy. So I'll work with her in a little bit. Adam is finding out what Parker needs to do. So he's the only one not doing something currently because he's waiting patiently. Okay, Jill, you ready for me to help you? You don't know? Are you sad? <laughs> Okay, so we have three kids all done with schoolwork, so they're on creative time. So they can color or draw or bake something. So we still have a couple kids working on school. But, oh, sorry. Okay, so I, Parker's already eating his free lunch, and that's fine, but they gave us a ton of fruit, which is good, because I was actually running low on apples, so I'm gonna just cut up these oranges for them. I like old sushi. So they can have snacks. Sorry about the background noise. Ali is doing Spanish online. Parker's having the uncrustable um, string cheese and carrot sticks, but I'm just going to cut up these oranges and make a snack on these. If they want to eat their lunch right now, they can. That's fine. I think Tiffany was going to eat her because they gave. They gave breakfast and lunch, so some of them were saving their cereals for tomorrow, but I think Tiffany was going to have her cereal for lunch, and that's fine. Because it's like cocoa puff stuff that I don't, that I don't buy. No wonder they like eating breakfast at school. <laughs> um, did you pick up that other game, Jillian? Alright guys. As you guys can see, I have this very beautiful Uncrustable. Really, give me a foot off the camera. Cocoa Puff. Gosh, it's coronavirus from the camera and I already touched it. What did you want? A pudding. Oh. No, that's for a snack. Have some carrot sticks, so it's nice. You can pee. You know what? Mom said you can read. Okay, so schedule time is interrupted because she has an appointment with her child psychologist. So we we're on our way to do that, and I told the kids to just have creative time or quiet time, just an hour of drawing, coloring. Um, they wanted to play Minecraft on electronics, but I told them no because I feel like they've been on their electronics too much and they do have two hours of free time later. So I'd rather them save that for, save electronics for that time. Um, they can finish up schoolwork if they wanted. No, don't take your shoes off. Ugh. I told them that it would be the perfect time with Kennedy gone to get out a big, one of their bigger puzzles or work on some music. Just, we'll see. We'll see if they, they listen. Put your shoes on. Okay, so we just got back from Kennedy's appointment and they were reading, so they stayed on task. So we're just gonna clean up. So before I totally end this vlog, me and Kennedy are gonna do a puzzle. Are you gonna do that puzzle? Yes. Okie dokie. Here.
Excuse you. There. This is. <laughs> Yum. Excuse you. What was that? Is that her butt? <laughs> so the schedule went pretty good today. I still have the older kids are working on their schoolwork still. Parker, come on. Get busy. What are you wearing? The little ones are pretty much done. A tiara. And then we have outside time and then dinner and we'll call it a day. Kennedy has given me a tiara, so I call today a success. Wednesday it's definitely going to change because all their online classes will start. I've done some puzzles with Kennedy and now she's playing with Adam having a tea what? party. Is that your baby? I don't know what's wrong with that one. <laughs> Maybe I'll play a game with her. So chicken tendies, stay safe and we'll see you guys next time. Um, yeah, that's it for today.